Hey YouTube, welcome to another video from the Apple School. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download torrents to your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. And this does not require a jailbreak and does not require a computer. All you're going to need is one application and I'm going to show you how to get it. The application is iTransmission and there are many ways to get this application. And the first one that I'm going to show you, it requires the Tutu app. The VIP version is not available on the regular version. So if you don't have the VIP version, you can still download the application, but it's going to require a computer, but it's not hard. And I also going to show you how to get it that way. Now, if you would like a chance to win a 2-2 VIP for one year, we are giving away a premium account for one lucky winner. And all you have to do is just go to my Twitter account at Apple Scoop and follow the instruction. All right so now i'm going to show you how to get eye transmission the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open the tutu app the vip one okay and here um what you could do is you can either scroll down and look for the application or you could just go to the search bar all the way on top and type eye transmission and once you finish typing you can hit search or go or enter and once you find the application you're gonna press what it says get and before it start downloading it's gonna say build this is so the application don't get revoked and this process might take a few seconds and sometimes minutes and also you don't need to stay in the application while this process is going on so if you have something to do want to do something extra you can just get out of the application and come back later and it's gonna be there or you could just wait for the process to finish so if you decide to wait once it finish it's gonna start downloading right away and now all we have to do is just wait for the download to complete and once it's done a pop-up window is gonna come up with the option to install tutu app would like to install iTransmission you're gonna press install and after that you could just press the home button and it's gonna be there or it's gonna be downloading. So now all we have to do is just open the application. And the first time that you open it, it's gonna ask you if you would like to get notification. You can hit allow or don't allow, it's not gonna interfere with how the application perform. All right, so this is how it looks. As you can see, it's really clean. All you have is one menu tab and it's all the way to the top left hand corner. So you can either tap at the menu or you can swipe from left to right and all the menu options are gonna come out. And here we have add torrent from the web, add torrent from URL, connect to remote transmission and preference. So we're gonna go to preferences and these are all the options that you get. I would suggest not to change anything except for what it says, enable downloading while in the background so that one you could just enable it because you might want to do something else while the movie or tv show or whatever you download and finish you know if you're downloading an hd movie or blu-ray movie you know it could take half an hour an hour or even longer so you might want to do something else so that's a good option so enable that and now i'm going to show you how to download with torrents so you're going to open safari and you're going to go to your favorite torrent site I'm gonna be using 1337X, but it doesn't matter which one you're using. You can use KitKat, Pirate Bay, or wherever site you use to download your torrents. They all gonna work the same. So I'm gonna choose one, um, the Lego Batman, the movie. So um, what you're gonna do here, you can either press Magnet Download or Torrents Download. Torrents Download will give you more options and you might have to go an extra step. But if you click Magnet Download, a window's gonna come up asking you if you want to open this in iTransmission and you're gonna hit what it says open and it's going to go straight to the iTransmission app. So all you have to do is wait for the movie to download. And if for any reason you want to pause this download, all you have to do is press that big red circle with the pause sign on it. And to continue downloading, all you have to do is press it again and the download is gonna continue. Now, if you press anywhere on top of the name of the movie that you're downloading, it's gonna take you to the detail page. In this page, what you're gonna do, you're gonna scroll down till you see what it says file, and you're gonna open file, and this is where your movie is gonna be at, or your video, or whatever you're downloading. And once it finished downloading, you can just press on the movie, 
and it's gonna ask you where you wanna play it. So you're gonna choose your favorite video player. So now I'm gonna show you another way to get eye transmission and you are gonna open Safari. Now, it's better for you to do all the downloads from your computer because you are going to need the computer to install iTransmission. Now, the site that I'm gonna use is IPA Rhino, but there are other websites and I'm gonna leave you some of them in the description. So the reason why I like this one is because it gives you more options. So press where it says more information and here you're gonna get a full description of the app that you're downloading and it's gonna give you two options to download. The first one is to download it with Signulus and the second one is to get the IPA file and that's the one we want. So we're gonna press the red one where it says IPA and it's gonna download to your computer and then you are going to silo the app to your iDevice using Cydia Impactor. Now, if you don't know how to silo apps to your iOS device, I'm gonna leave you the link in the description showing you how to do it. All right, so that's it for that part and we went back to iTransmission and as you can see it's still downloading so that's why you have to go to the menu and preferences and enable download in the background now um, I have to be clear this doesn't work all the time sometimes you get up from the application and it stops downloading and sometimes it continues download so why is this I don't know but it's good to have it enabled for those times that works okay so that's it for this one I hope you like the video if you like it please hit that thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you can get a notification as soon as we upload new videos also please share the video and if you have any question or anything to add please leave it in the comment and you can also follow us on twitter at apple school happy downloading till the next one